Hi everyone, I'm Lena the Plug and this is Haley Davies. And today we're gonna play Truth or Drink with what we just found out are not ginger shots, they're apple cider vinegar. Apple cider vinegar shots, which are so much worse. Yeah. I predict we answer more questions than we thought. Yeah, we would. I was definitely planning to skip some, but oh, ready? <laughs> okay, I'm just I wanna see you drink. Have it prepared in case. Name a celebrity that has been in your DMs that you would smash. <laughs> I feel like that I would smash. This that is tough. you would smash. I'm trying to think. I have to drink for this. I can't. I can't. Oh, I can't name call. Yeah, that's. Don't drink the whole thing. Yes. Ah! Wow, this is like really spicy. I'm gonna be sick. Oh my god, that's disgusting. Oh my god, that's gross. Don't drink that. To answer the question. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Have you ever rejected a collaboration? If so, name who. You don't want to drink that. <laughs> spicy, spicy, spicy. Yeah. Fuck. Okay. <gasps> We're such. The whole thing. The I'm going to get this ready. It has a uh, kick at the end. I was like, oh, it, it tastes like honey. No, it, it tastes like vomit. Oh my God. It smells worse than vomit. Oh my God. <laughs> it's really bad. It literally mm -hmm. tastes like vomit. Oh, has a nice little oh vomit aftertaste too. Where is the craziest place you've ever had? The high school basketball concession stands. Nice. When I was in high school. That's hot. Was that like just with another student? Yeah, me yeah. and the guy were like, we have to go to the nurse's office. And then we like met up and the concession stands for some reason were not locked. So, Ooh. Yeah. All right. Hot. <laughs> Since the beginning. Um, okay, my turn? Yeah. Call someone you've had sex with before and have them read it. Who wrote these? Did you guys make these? Can we call yeah. in the person that's here? Yeah. yeah. Go get him. <laughs> we just good. happen to have a guy oh, in the building. Two, two guys in the, in the building. building that she's yeah. Anyone else we should know about in the building that you There are other men in the building. Well, yes, but men. <laughs> uh, no. No? No one else. Anton! Hi! Mm. <laughs> well, I've been around a little bit, so okay. I would rate definitely Haley a f nine out of ten. Woo! Like, certified. Hey. Woo! When we first worked together, <laughs> first I like could like... take like, oh my god, it was the worst. But you could barely are, take have it. like a outlier. <laughs> outlier. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I've never and, heard that one yeah. before. I mean, it's, it's like there's like the the normal size. And then yours is just like over there on this <laughs> yeah. a little above average. scale, right. like a little, slightly above like, average. Yeah, right. it's just slightly. There's a reason he comes back for more, you know. Uh -oh. How many times do you get? Maybe six, seven. That's a lot. Yeah, I feel like there should be like a cutoff for how many times you're like the same guy. Yeah, I think my highest is J Mac and Mr. Lucky. Are I think they're around like 10, 12. Damien Daisky's around like nine. Yeah, Girl. and then Anton's like one of my oh Alex Jones is one of my highest. You a lot. Yeah, I don't even know if I've had that many times. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about the worst collab you have ever experienced. I'm not gonna name her, but there was a girl who came to set and was leaking boric acid on oh. the bed surface that we had on while we were doing photos, and I saw it, and there was it, yeah. So if you guys don't know, we use boric acid it's like a capsule that you put in your yeah and it just sanitizes that you think it smells weird you think something's coming on use yeah, it. yeah but you need to use it at night before you go to bed so that all of the fluids can like sort of leak out of you and then you wash it out in the morning yeah. you don't put it in right before you come to set yeah and i think that's what this person did and she was just also a nutcase so yeah that did was definitely my worst collaboration ever how many people have you had within the past year on the count of the three both say your answers okay in the past year like the last 12 months or Roughly. since january i don't know you do my bookings how many people have I one two three 80. 30. <laughs> all right I've done like a lot of scenes, but I've done a lot of repeats. So I feel like it's about 80 different people. I like your style. I mean, yeah. all of mine are like women. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. Team Drake or Kendrick, would you smash? Would I smash? Would you smash? 
I'm Team Drizzy and I would smash. Woohoo! <laughs> Name the person who has had the smallest you've ever seen and how small was it? <laughs> this guy that I hooked up with probably What's like 10 name? years ago. Michael. Michael. Did you make that up so you don't No! <laughs> no it was a really common name. No, it was, it was, it okay. was, it was. It was literally like three inches. Did like, it satisfy you? No. I mean, I didn't even end up like it. Like I kind of just like touched it, like f***ed it. And then I was just like, I made up an excuse. You're like, never mind. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> okay, I'll I'm pass. good. What's your most expensive purchase and how much was it? My house, it was two and a half million dollars. <laughs> Nice. Who do you want to film your dream scene with? I want to do a scene with Tiger. That's your dream guy? I feel like you can Just get Just because he does own, like, obviously there's all the ones I would rather do, but the one that I felt like could even maybe happen would be Tiger. Have you shot your shot? I've asked him and he was like, no, I don't do that anymore. Well, if you see this, she still wants it. How much do you make from slash yeah. Which was the smallest one? I, I, oh, I'll take this one. I would not. It was easy. Nice. Yeah. Yuck. Do you pee in the shower? <laughs> yes. Duh. Duh. What else do you get out? Do you, who, who would get out and sit on the toilet and flush it? <laughs> Freeze. Sitting on the toilet with a wet ass has to be one of the worst experiences in the, the world. Worst thing ever. Yeah. Have you ever flirted with a cop to save yourself? Honestly, I wish I could say that I was that slick. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm shaking. I'm like, I, yes, I did really. <laughs> what did I do? Name three exes and rank them from best to worst. Okay. Tim. Um, Made up name. No, <laughs> my first boyfriend. Okay. Tim was the best. Sam. The next one. These all sound made up. No, that's seriously. Sam and Tim and you Michael. Know what's so funny? No, the next one's also Sam. The one that lied about cancer. So that one's the worst. <laughs> Bro. Yeah. Tim. Sam, Don't Sam. ever date another Sam. I think that is what that's, the universe is trying to tell you. Do you know what's funny is that my you. family was saying that because I dated a Sam and then I dated another Sam and my, my cousin was just married to Sam. My other cousin just married to Sam and my whole family was like, everyone stop dating Sams. Have you ever slept with a married man? That's a count. No, I guess I've never slept with a married man. <laughs> what? Why are you shaking your head at me? You don't believe me? Oh yeah, I've slept with multiple married men. I'm lying. Did you just forget? Yes. Sometimes I do that. I literally forget things. And then someone's, I'm like, oh. How convenient. Uh, yeah, I was just reminded that I've slept with multiple married men. So I'm a liar. I'm <laughs> caught in the act. Okay. <laughs> Have you ever been yes really oh my god in australia it was horrible i was so lucky i like went out by myself and then i was so lucky that my friends came to meet up with me like just in time otherwise god knows what would have happened but you know what it like messes you up like i couldn't leave the house for days it was like this horrible kind of like depression do you think it was like a a random just like slipped it in your drink or did you like know who it was there was this guy that i was like kind of talking to not in that way like i was just like yawning at the bar you know and i think it would have been them yeah but i'm just so lucky that my friends came shout out to them so nothing happened yeah name your biggest turn on and and turn offs i really like arms i'm gonna be so shallow right now i'm like i like arms i like yeah. smiles <laughs> Turn offs, guys who flex their income on social media, yeah. guys who take front facing camera photos and they're being serious about it, <laughs> uh, like, a, like a selfie, like, you know, don't do that. Men who use their phone too much. Adam, I'm talking to you. What was the last thing you lied about? Ooh. All of your ex's names. <laughs> I wish. Drink, drink, yeah. Drink. Left a little bit in there. Stop it. <laughs> I see some at the bottom. No, mine's my subject too. Tell us a story about your craziest experience. I got invited to have a thing with a married couple and it was really fun. We did it together. And uh, at the end, I was like consoling them because I don't know if they were getting to a fight or not, but it was like one of my first and it was definitely new territory to me. It was before all of this. Yeah. 
Have you ever cheated? No. Never? No. Not never. even a like on it. No, I'm just kidding. Not even a... <laughs> No. No flirting? I've never... Well, I mean, flirting's like up to everyone's discretion. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Like people could... Intention to cheat? No. And I've never like flirted like via like message or like that kind of thing. Like I've always been like very loyal. Like I think in person, not intentionally, no. But people could always... People can say just because you were talking to a guy you're flirting. You yeah, know what yeah. I mean? it's true. There's so. the... Yeah. Wide range. Who is the best person you've ever collaborated with? I always think Carmen Carmen is my fave. She's cool. I've worked with she's her. She's a lot of fun. Yeah. I love her energy. She loves women. She loves eating pussy. Yeah. I miss you. Come hang out with me again. Eat my pussy again. Yeah. Oh my god. I would love to do like a girl, girl, girl with her. That would be fun. I can make it happen. What are your guilty pleasures? Okay. I have this really, really, really bad habit because I don't cook. Because I'm like, I work a lot. So I order from Uber Eats. But because I find the food in America like really bad, I've started getting in the habit of like ordering maybe like two or three mains just so that you on the options. chance that, yeah, I'll probably won't like them. And I need to at least like one of them. And then I just, I throw them out. I don't even keep them for lift it's really bad so would you say that the food in australia is a lot better or is it that they yeah. have different options better that we don't quality have? and just a lot nicer yeah a lot healthier but like better quality just tastes so much better yeah and it's funny because you think like you're making good money but then i guess when you get to the end of the tax year and you look back you're like so that's I, when i realized i spent 50k on postmates i literally spent yeah a 20 20k in six months on food, which is like a lot. That you threw half of it out. Yeah. You're a Probably bad person. You're a terrible human being. Yeah. So I've now like, I want to set up proper goals of like my spending because I would spend like over a grand a week. You should have just hired a private chef at that point, right? That's what my friend keeps telling me. We're going to help you yeah. out here. Yeah. We're going to give her some ideas. Yeah. <laughs> what was your first impression of me? That you're really tan. <laughs> how can I get that tan? <laughs> how, how can I get my <laughs> clothes together? <laughs> You have a lot of energy. You're yeah. when I look at you, I'm like, how do I? Because you're like newer, so I feel like you're like really excited about everything. And I used to be really excited. Yeah. And now I've been doing this for so long, and I'm like, I need to tap into this energizer Haley's bunny energy. over here. She's crazy. You guys don't even know half of it. Name three people on your no list. You're getting all the really tough questions. Do you have a no list? There is like a couple of names that I've like heard things about. But not really. Like, I don't have anything, like, in my phone. There's definitely people that have hit me up and I, like, haven't worked with them. But that's not, like, you're on my no list. Mm -hmm. But there's only one person I can think of that's actually on my no list. And you won't name them to not no. give this the shot? I, I don't like the whole naming thing. I think it's mean. All right. Yes. I can't even look anymore. Ugh. Who would be the next best candidate to have a solo boy-girl scene with? I would want to shoot with Manuel. Oh, he's great. He's like a legend. What's your relationship like with your parents? It's actually really good. Yeah. It wasn't when I was younger, but it's good now. But it didn't get worse when you started? No, because I started dancing. Okay, stripping? Um, yeah. My dad doesn't know, but... He still doesn't know? He doesn't know, but he's suspected. And I know that, like, if he found out, like, he's not going to disown me. It's just, I feel like he just doesn't need to know. I know that he would support me. It's just... It's just awkward. He just doesn't need to know. Yeah, you don't need to tell him. But my mom is, like, crazy supportive. Yeah. That's awesome. Like, she sees that, like, I'm happy, so... Yeah. You're happy. You're safe. You're doing your thing. Exactly. I'm safe. And she knows I'm smart and I don't get into, like, bad situations and stuff, you don't. So. Only with you. <laughs> we get up to no good. Would you sleep with Ryan Garcia? Yeah. You would? I think he's kind of cute. She likes him crazy. All right. I guess that's that's the end of this. We didn't have to drink all of these. I'm going to make you guys take one of these. Get over here. Get over here. Take a shot. She yeah. took two. I, I took, took one. I so took by the three. winner, or she the... I took three and you oh, took two. Oh, damn. You took a lot more. So I guess me. you're the winner. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to me. Subscribe to Haley. Yay. Thank you. Bye. And subscribe to Plug Talk, obviously. We love Plug Talk.